the next lesson, which is in the mangrove tree. We got some words. Let's uh, introduce it together because we're going to have a dedication. Let's move on. We got the word difficult, good, bad, mystery, suddenly, and some adjectives. We're going to talk about them again. So, difficult, what does it mean? It means something I can't do. It's hard. What's the opposite of difficult or what is the opposite of hard? Yeah? Easy. Easy. Again? Easy. Again? Easy. Again? Awesome. Very good. So, we move on to another word which means good. We got the word good and we got the word bad. What do you see between good and bad? Do they, are they antonyms or synonyms? They are antonyms. They are opposites to each other. True. Absolutely true. Time. When I use good in a comparative, or I make it in a comparative, I say better. And then when I talk about it in superlative, I say best. Like, for example, Ahmed is a good boy. But when I compare Ahmed with Mahmoud, I say Ahmed is better. Better than Mahmoud. But very good. When I say that Mahmoud, he is the, I'm talking about Mahmoud, yes. or Ahmad is better than Mahmoud. So when I compare uh, Ahmad to Mahmoud, but Ahmad is more and more better than Mahmoud. So I'm going to say that Ahmad is the best. The best, exactly. So very Awesome. The opposite with bad. Same as I did with good, better, and best, I'm going to do with bad. But in comparison with two persons, okay, say Masala, Amira and Delilah. Amira is a bad girl, okay? Amira is worse than Laila, okay? Amira is the worst. The worst, exactly. So we have used these adjectives in comparative and superlative. Right. How about the word mystery? We got the word mystery in our lesson. What does it mean? I know thing. I know thing. Uh, it's uh, ambiguous. I don't know anything about it. I have. Do I have information about this thing? No. No lack of information. Exactly. So that I'm going to know yes. about it. A known thing, mystery. Then suddenly, surprising. We don't expect to happen. Then some adjectives we got, which are worried, surprised, and confused. 